Welcome back to yet another part of top 50 Excel shortcut series. If you have not seen the earlier part of this series then please see it because you are missing something very important. I have provided the link of the same in the description box below. This is the 10th and the final part of this series. So stay tuned. Hello, I am your tutor and welcome to my channel Learn in 5 minutes. So let's start. Number 46. Toggle full screen. Control Shift F1. Shortcut toggles of full screen mode that hides both the ribbon and status bar. When the formula bar is visible, this provides space to view eight more rows. When the formula bar is hidden, this shortcut shows 10 more rows in a worksheet. There is no equivalent shortcut available in Mac. However, control command F toggles full screen mode in almost any window although it won't toggle the ribbon or status bar in excel number 47 open vba editor the vba editor is the application we use to write macros and create user forms it can be opened by clicking the visual basic button on the developer tab in excel the keyboard shortcut to open the vb editor in any windows version of excel is alt f11 and function options f11 in mac number 48 zoom in and zoom out control alt plus in windows and command options plus in mac zooms in on the current worksheet making items larger and easier to read in windows the contents get zoomed by 15% every time you use this shortcut similarly in this shortcut use minus instead of plus to zoom out you can also use control along with mouse scroll wheel to zoom in or zoom out on both windows and mac number 49 open the insert function dialog box the insert function dialog box is designed to simplify the task of using functions in your worksheet the dialog box not only helps you to locate the proper function for the task at hand but also provides information about the arguments that the function takes you can open this dialog box by using shift f3 in windows and function shift f3 in mac number 50 evaluate part of formula use f9 in windows and function f9 in mac to evaluate parts of a formula this is not really a keyboard shortcut but rather just a trick you can use to find out how excel evaluates part of a formula as it is calculated there is a great way to check a formula to find out how it works or to debug a formula when it isn't working properly i hope this shortcut will change the way you work in excel if you found this video useful please like and share this with your friends and if you have not subscribed to this channel do it right now and press the bell icon beside the subscribe button so that you don't miss on any new videos that i upload see you soon in my other series thanks for watching